Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, uh, I know the green screen looks a bit different. We're, we're making it more wide, um, so sorry about that. What we're doing today is we are previewing the semi-finals for this week. And, um, so yeah, this should be fun. Let's get go through the games. I'm going to go through my predictions, my tips. And yeah, let's get into it. Alright, so first up, Friday night is the Tigers versus Saints. I will be streaming this game on the UCAP podcast. Link in the description. Be a great time. I've had great fun on my two final streams last week. But if I have a look at the ins and outs quickly, Richmond out and have got Arts, who's being a bigot, and Mubby or Chol, who's being a bigot. And then ins, Tom Lynch and Nathan Broad. That is huge for the Tigers. And for the Saints, it's not looking good. Ben Long out, suspended. Carlisle out, I'm pretty sure he's flying to Queensland. And Paddy Ryder is out with a pretty bad hamstring injury. But they're ends. They've got Marsh, Bagel, and Savage. Still, though, I think the Saints really... You just really can't predict the Saints winning this. You just can't predict the Saints winning this. That's why I see this Hags winning, but not too big of a win, but by 11 points. And move on to play Port Adelaide in prelim final one. Next up, it is, we've only got two games here this week. It'll be a nice and short video, but we've got the Cats and we've got the Pies. This is going to be such a great, great game. I was going to stream this game. I had it scheduled for a long time. I do really want to stream the game this week, so I'll do Friday night. Even though I'm pretty sure Cardi's also doing it, but... Will I really still view us off Big Cloud? Cardman 22. Yeah, Geelong Cologne with this. It's going to be a fantastic game. The winner goes on to this. Brisbane in prelim final number two. Jeez, it's tight. A lot of people are saying the Pies. I think the Cats probably should be able to get over the line, though. We'll see, though. I'm going to have a look at the ins and outs. I could change my mind. I can't actually find the ins and outs for the Cats and the Pies. But in this match, it's a hard tip. I just said the Cats before. Do I stick with my gut? Because the, the Cats still are a very good team. But they're going out in straight sets in 2020. I'm going to go the Pies in a thriller by two points. That means Collingwood would move on to the prelim, which means if that happens, the prelim finals will be set up for the Power and the Tides at the Adelaide Oval and the Lions and the Pies at the Gabba. I know this might sound crazy, Collingwood's the eighth place team making a prelim, but it cool happening in my eyes. I don't think we should get too overhyped about the Pies. They, they did only win one elimination final, but still they were looking very good Last week, the Cats, not so good. There go the Pies there. And yeah, it will make up for a very good prelim finals, which I'll be previewing next week. I'll be probably streaming. Yeah, I don't want to say I'm streaming Richmond Saints on Friday night. It might it might be tonight by the time I'm playing this, or tomorrow night. Um, but poor Richmond's Brisbane and Collingwood. If that does happen, I'll be streaming one of those. And we never know if we'll stream the Granny. I hope you enjoyed this short and snappy video and see you later.